we will uh, show you how to create a custom permission first you have to um, go to custom permissions um, pay screen uh, let's talk about the what custom permissions are custom permissions is to give um, youth access to custom processes and apps um, so for example uh, if you want to um, access to a permission to a button in a visual force page you can do that um, so this is how you create a, a custom uh, permission you go to um, Salesforce page uh, Salesforce uh, console go to setup enter custom permissions in the quick find box new uh, and uh, my custom permission um, license required for uh, we just leave it um, description is optional so uh, the, those are the connected apps so um, you have to select a connected app for which you Provide the uh, custom permission like this um, and then click save here. So, this is um, how you create a, a custom permission. You want to edit it, you click edit button. Um, so, this is required custom permissions, no custom permission are specified click edit here um, these are the available one you you want to uh, assign uh, to this custom permission right now I have none here you can available custom permission for for this custom permission so um, that's how it works uh, if you go to um, say their Salesforce page uh, documentation there there are good uh, information this is a this is the definition of custom permission and then how you create it and then connected app optionally the um, so this is for example so um, yeah um, add remove custom permissions uh, you have to go to quick sign box and then add a custom permission and edit and remove it yeah um, uh, if you go to custom permission detail page um, you can delete it if you if you don't want the uh, custom permission so this is uh, how you do that um, uh, good luck